a room in the tower. A young man repeatedly gets a nightmare that he is visiting a friend's house whose family is weird. The male fallen mother of his friend, Mrs. Stone, allows a dreadful room in a huge tower for him to retire. His nightmare repeats but keeps wearing every night and characters in the dream keep growing over the years. In his dream, one day, Mrs. Stone expires and she is buried. But she still keeps assigning the same room to him. In the young man's normal life, his friend Clinton invites him for dinner one day. He is surprised to see that everything matches with the nightmare. But the personalities and the names are different and he has an enjoyable experience. Due to a thunderstorm warning, Clinton's mother advises him to stay with the family that night and allots a room that is similar to one he sees in his nightmares. He is shocked at the resemblance. In the room, he finds a very old painting of Mrs. Stone. With the help of Clinton, he moves the painting to the hall. They are amazed to see their hands covered in the blood even though neither of them is injured. They go to bed but the young man is unable to fall asleep and walk up in the horror to find Mrs. Stone standing on the top of his bed. She tells him that she is a vampire and is here to turn the young man also into a vampire. They get into a fight and he manages to escape. When he rushes out of the room, Clinton comes out of hearing the commotion. They discover that Portrait is back on the wall in his room. They get scared and flee away. An old newspaper carries the news that Mrs. Stone Coffin keeps erupting every day and has to be liberated. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching this video.